Choosing the right high frequency EMF monitor can be tricky. First of all, there's many different elements to EMF that need to be measured, but by far the most important one is high frequency. And of course, these days with the advent of 5G, we want to be sure that we've got the right monitor and we can measure all the aspects. So you need a monitor that can measure uh, 2G, 3G, 4G, 5G, Wi-Fi, routers, cell towers, mobile phone masks, baby monitors, cordless phones. It, the list is endless. How do you get the right one? That's what we want to look at here. And it isn't actually that massively technical. You just need to make sure that all the frequencies that you want to cover are covered by the monitor. So how do we decide on what monitor to buy? Well, first of all, if you want super high pinpoint accuracy to build the next mobile phone network, then you need a 50, 60,000 pound spectrum analyzer. If you just want to keep you and your kids safe, you need to spend somewhere between 250 and 500 pounds. Anything above that would be a waste of money. And below that, you're probably not going to get the accuracy and cover all the the frequencies you need to, to, to measure. So what do you need to know about the monitor? How do you make that decision? So you've got your budget, you need to pay between 250 and 500 pounds. You want to measure high frequency. So you want to know about all the things we've talked about. And of course, many of you will come to this video because you want to understand 5G as there is much conjecture about quite how dangerous to, to health this will be. And of course, it's a new technology rolled out with any consideration to health. So we won't know that for maybe one, two, ten, twenty years. Now, up until the advent of 5G, only had to cover from 200 megahertz to around about 8 gigahertz. But when the advent of 5G arrived and we needed to cover up to 70 gigahertz, not 8 gigahertz anymore, but 70, then things started to get a little bit more tricky. But the good news is there is one monitor, and only one at the moment, that covers all of those frequencies. It's the FM5. So what do we need to fully understand before we order the monitor that we believe will measure all aspects of 5G? What we need to know is that there are many monitors on the market claiming to measure 5G. Problem is, they only cover up to 8 gigahertz. But what's being rolled out right now as we speak is the millimeter wave in the 20 to 40 gigahertz region. 70 gigahertz is on the way, and so you really need a monitor now, today, that will measure 70 gigahertz. The only monitor on the market at the moment that does that comes from EMF protection. It's called the FM5, and you can order it today. So to recap, if we want to be sure that there's no high frequency radiation in our home, school, or office environment, we need a monitor that today will read 40 gigahertz and has the potential to read 70. Anything less than and 20 will only give you half the story. Choose the FM5 and have peace of mind.